Today we're going to show you how to make a decent bald eagle balloon. I can't see any eagle. I just made that up for I have a tail. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Like the littles. Okay, stop. But they used to, they always have a, 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 a puffy thing at the end. Yeah. It takes four 260s or possibly five if you want to give it feet. For the body, you actually want to inflate it most of the way, so don't leave much of a tail. Yeah, like, like a um, little tail. I know. For the eyes and the head, tails. for the eyes and beak and the head, it doesn't really matter because you're not going to use all of it. Uh huh. If you can inflate several balloons at once and time together without time separately, that's a time saver for you and every second counts when you're doing line work. When you're making a design where several pieces are linked together, it really helps to actually tie them together. Don't just twist them together. Physically tie them together. So on this one, all three tie together in the same spot. Nope. Stronger than bubbles, okay? Now you can make your body, decide how long you want it to be. You're gonna be making four of these and a tail, so keep that in mind when you're making it. Yes. Is the tail in the way? Yes. Sorry. Oh, the tail has the arms Try to keep them about the same size. Make a tail, a loop for the tail. Attach it in there. And then come down with the other part and break off the excess. But today he uses like, oh god, because he just, because he just snowed the driveway. Snowed the driveway? Come on. Sorry. Took all the snow off the driveway. And Angelica, that has nothing to do with the video. So. Take the end you broke and it helps to tie that in or at least twist it in really good. Now you're going to make the head and the eyes at the same time. Decide how long you want the head and keep it proportional to the body. If you care. Take the white and come back down the other side. Keeping it the same size. Twist it together. Now's a good time to make the beak. Make two very small pinch twists. They're gonna be on each side of the beak, keeping it straight. So two very small ones like that. Pinch twist each of them individually. For the beak, I like to make a very small piece here and then a much longer one over the top to give it that curved uh, hooked look. So you have that and then you twist them all together in there. And break off the excess. And I, whenever I did this, I used to always like to give it to the kid because they always got a kick out of that happening. And then tie this off really good. So now you have that. And I have a tail. Yeah. And she wants to make us pointy ears so we'd be the littles. Okay. So take this uh, white balloon and bring it back over the eyes. Twist it around here and bring it back down here to the body. Here. And break off the excess. Something like that. For the wings, you take a balloon and inflate it all the way. And without tying this end individually, I'm going to tie it directly to the tail. Want me to hold that? Nope. 
Take it like that. How am I take? Divide it in half. Put it together. Loop through. Very useful design. I use this in a lot of things. Put that in through the eagle body. And of course, like that uh, doesn't look so great, at least in my opinion. So come around here, somewhere partway, not quite in the middle, but somewhere partway towards the back. Grab it and twist it a bunch of times. And do the same on this side. Try to keep them about the same size. So you have wings like that. And at this point, you draw your eyeballs on. And if the kid's going to fly it around, you attach one of these, uh, a stick onto it. I, I like the clear ones. Mm -hmm. Here, hold that. You can make the wings have a sharper curve like this, although I think that's not very well suited to an eagle. Or if you have the time, you can make wings like this. That's uh, reasonably simple to make, although not as fast as that, obviously. You make a, a straight balloon, make a series of bubbles, tie them together, make another balloon that's the same length as that, and then another series of bubbles coming back here and tie it together really well. So, you can, instead of using that one, you can use that one. So there's another variation of the eagle that you can do. Helen's with a fish in them. No. Come on. Now I'm going to make one with talons. Helen's with a fish. Wasn't planning to put a fish in it, but maybe. <laughs> and I can do a slight variation on the body design so that you can angle the head where you want it. Making the usual starting of the body. Come back over here where you're going to make the tail. Make a loop for the tail. Look it in. Twist it in. Yeah. Stop. Stop. So you come back over here. Instead of breaking off the excess, make yourself a small, uh, uh, not a small, but a decent sized loop or pinch twist. Twist that into here, and it's going to allow you to position the head. Then we do the head. Nope. I do, I do see it when you do that. Yeah. twist there you can make the head pointed a little more forward I didn't know how to make or if you put the feet this way that would be sideways okay. you know like that if you felt like it do you want having a piece of fish in its mouth no what now obviously you can make talons very fancy with multiple claws on them but if you're in any kind of rush or there's people watching you want to make just fast feet just a basic loop like that works and pinch twist this off and then I helped, uh, and then I found it always helped to push that through the, the loop. Push the pinch twist through the loop. Nope. I'm working right now. Okay. Decide how long you want the legs to be. Don't forget. Tie them in here to the tail. Don't forget the fish. Stop. You can um, pretend it's flying along with its legs out, going to grab something, or you can use it to perch it onto something. You can put it right onto a stick or onto some some balloon up here so the person can wear it on the shoulder. No, no, no. I want to have a fish in its feet. I want to have a fish in its feet and say it on my tail. Say it on my tail. That would be funny. Oh, and I want you to have one on your tail too. Okay, so to finish it off, uh, matching leg, another little loop, small pinch twist. 
break off the excess, tie it off. And I like to push that pinch twist through the loop. You want to put a fish in it, you're going to have to have get me a balloon. A gray what balloon or something. I don't know. But the gray balloons are all the way there. I don't know. So, I'm going to put some wings in there. Ah, my tail! Ah, no problem. How's that fish coming along, Angelica? The eyes on, and there you go. You can perch that onto something, um, or you can just make it like that if the person really wants legs. So it's really not hard and actually reasonably fast to do. So she really wants a fish to go with that. And uh, let me show you the world's simplest fish, uh, but it's, unfortunately it's a bit too small for this setup. Take a silver heart, stretch the neck out really, really good, and put a tiny little puff of air because you really just want to inflate a little bit at the end of the neck. Like that. So you tie it off with a little puff of air in there. Uh, that becomes a tail. You can even put eyes on it. Kids love it when you put eyes on it. When someone, hang on. When somebody wants a uh, fish on a fishing rod, I would do something like this because it's, uh, you know, oh, hey, I got a really small fish. Uh, if you make a penguin and it's holding a fish, well, this is a perfect one for it. Let's see that eagle. So even though it's a bit small for this eagle here, when you're in a lineup and there's a lot of people around, you just got to do something fast. Sure, you can make a fancy fish, but this one here actually works. They can't argue. Yep, that's a fish. You didn't say you wanted a big one. And Angelica, you didn't say that you wanted a big one, so this is the fish you get. I did want a big one, but I wanted a medium sized one. Well, this eagle, here, we can even attach it to his beak instead. There. How'd you have the. Yeah. No, he's eating. No, 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 no. No, I have an idea. I have an idea. Later. Okay, hey, stop, stop, stop. Uh, Jalika, stop. I want to the sea. Yeah. Stop, stop. There you go. So many varieties of bald eagle that you can make. Give it a girl. My tail. It's brown, not skin color. Brown. I can tell because of. The eyes of well, I don't have brown, I have black. Mm -hmm. Just put a black one. Okay. Or oh. purple. How about a purple one? That's crazy. It'll look cool. You'll have to make some black lines. Like bigger the, than that? Yeah. Don't forget, you'll have to make some black lines to like, make it like it's puffy. No. Like it. That's better. Okay, stop moving, stop moving. Okay? Stop, stop, stop. Stop moving, stop moving. Stop moving, stop moving. Stop moving, stop moving.